U.S. stocks are pointing to a lower start on Monday amid a cautious start to the week and after strong gains across the month of November. Boosted by expectations that the Federal Reserve has finished hiking interest rates, the S&P 500 closed its highest level this year on Friday, with year-to-date gains of almost 20%. Meanwhile, the Nasdaq 100 has surged 37% across 2023. The market shrugged off comments by Federal Reserve Chair Jerome Powell on Friday as he pushed back on rate cut bets. However, he did say that interest rates were sufficiently restrictive, suggesting that peak rates have been reached, fueling expectations that the next move by the Fed will be a rate cut. There will be no further updates from Federal Reserve officials this week as the central bank enters its blackout period ahead of the meeting on the 12th and 13th of this month. Data today will come from factory orders which are expected to fall to 2.5% mom in October, down from after rising 2.8% in September. However, the main focus will be on Friday's non-farm payroll, which is expected to show that the US economy added 180,000 jobs in November, after 150,000 jobs were added in October. Weaker jobs data could fuel the central bank cut narrative, lifting stocks further. Corporate news. Cryptocurrency exchange Coinbase will be in focus and is set to open sharply higher. After Bitcoin rose above $40,000 for the first time this year, to a 19-month high of just below $42,000. Spotify is set to rise after announcing that it's planning to lay off 17% of its workforce in a move to reduce costs. Uber is set to open over 4% higher, with the right hailing service set to join the S&P 500 index as of December 18. Virgin Galactic is falling over 14% after British billionaire Richard Branson ruled out. Additional investment for the space travel company. S&P 500 Forecast Technical Analysis The S&P 500 is pausing from breath after its recent grind higher hit resistance, just shy of 4,600. The July high. A rise above 4,600 is needed to extend gains towards 4,640. The March 2022 high. Meanwhile, support can be seen at 4,535, last week's low with the break below here opening the door to 4,500, the September high. The USD is edging higher on Monday, regaining some lost ground after falling for three straight weeks on expectations. That the Federal Reserve will soon start cutting interest rates. This week, the main focus for the dollar will be Friday's non-farm payroll results, which could provide further insight into the health of the US labor market. ER or UST is falling towards 1.085 on bets the ECB could be the first major central bank to raise interest rates next year. The market is fully pricing in an April rate cut. Eurozone investor sentiment improved slightly to minus 16.8 from minus 18.6, but missing forecasts of minus 14.4. This was the 22nd straight reading of negative investor confidence, as the index hasn't been above the zero mark since February 2022.